What's up, YouTube? cod 4 man 221 here, and welcome back to another part of the USA campaign for Hearts Iron 4. Base, I've been looking around here, so we have a, do have a shortage of rubber. So we're actually gonna, we're also being accompanied by the, the radio here. I'm also gonna trade away one civilian factory to get some more rubber, so that will give us a surplus. And we need a national focus. Now, I don't necessarily want to go into War Plan Orange just yet. I feel like that provoked the Japanese. So I'm going to actually go on. I don't know if I want to do... I'm debating between... Actually, I want to do amphibious operations. This will help us with our transport models for our Marines. Okay, now the other thing I was looking at... Okay, so in the last time, it was pointed out to me that if we go on to airplanes here... That you can just actually just click this and it researches. Now I knew they had the symbols there, but you actually have to click the symbol to start it researching. So I'll start researching that once we finish all of our technologies here, and then I'll start. You know, we're not going to use the the hawk here. We're going to use the war hawk or even the air cobra on our aircraft carriers. So we'll unpause it as things start getting uh, built here. Let's see. We have our marines getting into position. In fact, we have those guys are still in the position here. I think these guys... Okay, we have actually... Yeah. Okay. So we want to keep invading... These islands here. Good. And then your army... Go from here. And invade that island. And then we have the other army... These guys are still getting into position all the way down here. I'm telling you, Japan, when it comes, we're, we're gonna, it's going to be a firestorm. <laughs> we're going to hit all these bases. It's going to be great. So we are getting political power still. We're missing equipment still on our light tanks. We actually have some more. So we had a free military factory, but immediately got switched... Actually, the planes are fine. Let's make some more tanks. I know tanks really aren't that useful on island. On islands, it's, tanks are better for like breakthroughs in Europe. But you know, we can still get a couple, maybe. I do. I am actually. I think I have. Have I done logistics company? I have logistics company too. So I just want to change my template for Marines here. I'm going to add the Logistics Company. Now what this will do is it will basically... Should we give them artillery? We don't have enough. Uh, basically what we're going to be doing with that is it's going to help us when we're on the... Basically on these islands that don't have great supply. Okay, we just completed that. I could get weapons too... I'm gonna wait. I do want to get the aircraft and start researching that. That way we can get aircraft on our aircraft carriers that are like not air war fighters. We apparently have low supply out here. That's a lot of attrition actually. I believe if you go to construction and we like improve the infrastructure out here this may that may actually just help another free military factor was going to keep putting a couple into the tanks here I'm actually gonna maybe I should keep a couple free ones because we you know we're gonna need I'd make planes And uh, I believe, besides Mexico, also Guatemala. If we go into the resource map down here, Guatemala does have these chromiums, which I think, I don't know if we actually need those. Yeah, we do need them. What other, yeah, not really good in El Salvador. Nothing, nothing else really we need. Cuba. A bunch of steel. 
Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm we're like have the we have the fascists rising in Japan and Germany and Italy, and we're worried about Cuba and like Mexico. Okay. So this guy's army is here. And we're gonna go. Do you wanna we do we do have an invasion there? Okay, so we basically have if we count here, we have six islands that are gonna be invaded once the war starts, and we have our navy patrolling out there. You know what I think it is? I think it's that I have all these troops on these islands. These guys actually don't have a naval invasion order yet, so I'm gonna actually pull them off. Is there any other island I can use? I'm gonna pull them to this little island because that will hopefully relieve some of the, the pressure on this island. These guys didn't have a naval invasion plan anyway, I don't think. Or maybe they did. Is Collins the fifth army? Yeah, maybe they actually... I'll have them invade here. So they can get in position. That should hopefully help with supplies. It's tricky fighting over here. The good news is, is that that stopped with our attrition. I guess I just had too many units on the island. So it's kind of hard to do, like, uh, Iwo Jima, where there's like 23,000 Japanese and... This is actually a great base. Uh, I was built. This is actually a, a nice area to basically fought my bombers over Japan. Uh, also, Okinawa over here historically was very, very good also with that. Someone was suggesting that I lend lease to the Philippines. When I did the first, now every game is different, but when I did the first kind of playthrough on multiplayer in the United States, the, the Japanese didn't even bother with the Philippines. I don't know if I got lucky or something. I want to go to tank research here. Let's get the Lee or the Chaffee. Let's go with the Lee. And construction's coming along quite nicely here. I do need to work on better industry, though. I don't... I keep getting ahead of time here. Maybe an excavation. These might help. And yeah, we did go with concentrated industry because we don't really have any issues. Look at this, this really helps, these improved tools with production. Awesome, we have an amphibious operation. Maybe we should have waited. We have a new national focus. That just, well, we just finished the amphibious operation. Like, this doesn't really help. Let's go for the air division. I want to do air support. I want to have my bombers help cover my soldiers here. Okay, we have one marine division here. Are we still training more? Yeah, we're training a ton of marines, actually. I might... Once these, some of these units finish, I'm going to start canceling some of them because we have so many. Uh, we have a ton of marines, and that, that's a good thing. Uh, but I don't think we have the islands currently to support all these. You know what? I'll send them to the Philippines. You know, this can... I can plan a naval invasion on from the Philippines um, toward... It may even be worth, like, hitting Japan right here. I could take Taiwan and, I don't know, maybe take... You know, I could do an Okinawa invasion. Yes, that would be great because we could take these little islands over quickly and then push towards... Um, take Maybe stab a Japanese in the back here, do a naval invasion here with all our marines. There are a bunch of mountains, though. But if we take Taiwan, kind of push the Japanese back from here. I don't know, they may even connect, so maybe it's just better to take Taiwan and Okinawa. Get close to the Japanese homeland here. And I would actually like to do... You know what? Let's, let's get uh, one more marine unit up here. And then we'll... Maybe two. And I do want to take these islands from the Japanese in the north. Uh, my plan for the, the naval... I should actually unpause this. The plan for my naval invasion in Japan is... Uh, when I first tried this on my multiplayer campaign with someone else... I invaded Nagasaki here and I had one port. So we had really poor supplies. And the Japanese will just keep attacking us. So I need to... I'm gonna have multiple invasions. Each little island, so we're gonna invade where the we're gonna take near Nagasaki, we're gonna invade near Kochi, Hiroshima, 
near Tokyo. Like, I just want to hit them. I want to actually, it might be even better just coming from one front from the top here and have one in the bottom and then kind of just hit in the middle, um, kind of where, right here. Like, I'm, this is going to be a full invasion here, and I hope I can do it successfully. Uh, we're giving our, our soldiers the technology to do that, hopefully. So we actually are storing up fighters, which is excellent. We're not even making the naval bomber. We can make some of these. These guys... Switch these guys over. I need some more songs in this game. And I still have my large fleet out here. Give them a little admiral here. Frank. And I want them to patrol the eastern seaboard. Ecuador owns that. Oh, this is the Galapagos Islands. This is where Charles Darwin, like, supposedly, you know, that's where he uh, figured out about evolution. I like this. We have all these lines and invasions ready. This is going to be fun. Now, can we... Yeah, we can actually... We have the air supremacy... Well, not... Not here, but... Wait a second. Where? I'm going to delete this order here and redraw it. I don't know why you're saying some divisions that have not yet reached their starting position. That seems... I mean, he has... He has four divisions right here. Let me remake this army with William here. Okay, where'd he go, William? We have so many commanders, it's awesome. I don't know why you have no... I don't know. You can have a front line here. I, I don't know. Maybe you should... Hey, we got decryption done. And construction three. I'm going to encrypt my own stuff here. Construction three is done. Let's go back to industry. Only... Actually, wait. We had the transport things, right? This is half off, so I'm just going to get landing craft. Even though landing craft don't come in until like 1940. Well, actually, we're not that far off. Okay, so what the hell is going on with this guy's army? I don't... They have orders. Their orders are... Awesome. Okay, we got the bomber. Good. Well, we have the, the fighter here. Okay, Air Cobra is too far. Someone want me to research the, the lightning here? I don't really use heavy fighters. Okay, we're half off on anti-tank. Don't have to worry about the da that. The Japanese don't really have tanks. Let's get the upgraded artillery, maybe? Logistics is half off, but I'm three years ahead. Let's get some better recon, actually. Okay, well these guys are going to sit here. They, they seem fine. I can launch the attack order. I think. I don't know. We'll see if more actually breaks. Let me know if I'm doing anything wrong. Um, see, I don't get that. They're all here. There's four of them. See, you're fine. Current flying strength is six percent. Huh. Weird. 
Well, I'll try to execute these battle orders anyway. We'll, we'll see if it doesn't work. We're waiting on production here. They'll be done in like a day, a lot of these actually. We're about to have a ton of marines. Okay, I want to get my naval. Actually, hold on. Cut two of you off. Let's make another. Can make the carrier fighter. There we go. So, ten a year. It's killing our efficiency. There we go. A little bit more. 1.3 a month. Good. These guys have all their... Oh, they're missing some motorized equipment. Are we not producing any motorized equipment? Is... Yeah, you know, we're not producing any motorized. So that's what's slowing everybody up. I think these guys actually want one of the inner war fighters here. Next one, we'll go to those guys. So we can actually get four a week, so that will that help our need. Air divisions have been planned here. So strategic bombing versus tactical bombing, and if we, if we look at our research here for airplanes, strategic bomber is the flying fortress. And the tactical are these guys here. So tactical gives you like the close air support, which is nice. And these guys just do the infrastructure, so I don't think it really matters that much. Let's go for the uh, air support so we can get the uh, tactical bomber. This just gives us some research bonus. Oh, German Reich. <laughs> Just claimed something. Okay, now it's telling me that we have battle plans and no units assigned. So that has a unit assigned. Weird. Okay, your army. Are you guys assigned to this? Yeah, I'm struggling with this. I'm trying to. Those are burdens. Is this like a glitch or something? Like no... I'm sure someone will tell me in the comments down below what I'm doing wrong here. Yeah, I highlighted your army. You're supposed to execute that battle plan. Okay, Recon Company 2 is done. I'm so tempted to do logistics, that would be amazing. Working on our tanks, our artillery needs to be worked on. Okay, control click to select the units to this. And why can't you? Oh, 
Where research more transfer technology increased naval. Oh, our ports. Maybe it's something with our transports. I'm gonna cancel this. Whatever. We're we're researching our landing craft now. Okay, so let's read this here for a second. So it was saying. Okay, I have four divisions. I need to research more transfer technology to increase my naval invasion capacity. Okay. Landing crafts it is. So we're researching that currently. Good. Okay, now I... Okay, I just figured out... Okay, now now we know what we're doing a little bit. So we have a couple, a couple of these that just need... Like most of them. Like four of them need more landing craft because the dockyard isn't up to par. Okay, so sorry if I just frustrated you guys the last two minutes trying to figure that out. I am still new to the game, and it's it's still only been out for like a couple days here. Some more marines. Oh yeah, so it's gonna cancel production or slow it down on marines. Yeah, we have way too many. Our armor divisions are doing well. They're in Texas here. Once we get the the Lee, we're gonna switch over to that because the light tanks are decent, and you can also research various upgrades for them. I think the Sherman is a pretty good tank in this game. What was I was doing something about the Sherman the other day, and we're at forty four percent. Can we do anything with that? Eighty percent world tension. I'm going to go down the rubber reserve just to give us a bunch of production of rubber in Kentucky. So this will... See, this gives me claims on all this stuff. I do want to go down this research thing also, Arsenal for Democracy. These, these are great things to the United States. So look at the Chi look at the Chinese just getting their buckets while the Japanese here. And sure, you did have you had the uh, Chen Kai Shek. Here he is, Chen Kai Shek, who led the regular China and the other Republic of China, and these were the communists led by Mao Zedong, which eventually became the People's Republic of China, which it is today. Let's see, so Germany has Austria. It took over a little bit of something else. It took over. This used to be part of Czechoslovakia. It took this to Dayton land. I think we're gonna have World War II here soon. It is 1939 March. Let's speed it up a little bit. We're just. We don't really have a whole lot more. Oh yes, I did want to assign like four Marines into another army here, and I want to put them. here. Now what, I need to also build up some of my ports too around. I'm hoping that once that research finishes that will that'll really help. Okay, so I really time to do logistics 3 just to make our supply a lot lower. So each one of these gives 10% We're like 500 days ahead though. Signal Company actually gives organization, so that's actually pretty good. 20 organization there. Okay, some more military factories. Okay, let's research some carriers, fighters, bombers. Okay, we did the research for the artillery. Just to improve our artillery here is a good thing. I really want my landing craft to be done. See, when we're landing, we have no organization whatsoever. So let's see, we're still negative on our light tank. That's okay. Our, our carrier fighter, we're actually pretty positive. Let's take a look at some of our navies here while we're waiting. This is my destroyer for Tilla. Do we have... This is a carrier. Yep. Czechoslovakia has fallen to Germans. Okay, so we completed this. In 
interesting. Let's go for this one, though. Okay, we're back at our bombers here. We're still low on something. Rubber again. I think I'm taking all of the rubber. British Raj. I don't want to send stuff all the way from, from there. Get some more from the United Kingdom, I guess. This is why I need rubber, because we're going to have to... These are going to be convoys, right? I don't want to send convoys across the whole Pacific <laughs> from uh, India there. Okay, I'm going to unpause this. Yep, and Italy just took Albania here. Yeah, I almost froze the game there for a second. These guys are along the eastern seaboard. I just want to look at my... I guess I can see my planes here, yes. Naval bombers, naval bombers. Okay, good. This is our... Okay, these are our fighters. So we're going to have 55 when we're producing fighters. We need 93, so... I think with the upgrade of the aircraft carriers also... I'm just going to put a couple more factories on there when we keep making some more. I need to build some more construction. We're actually almost done. You know, I actually want to build a naval base out here. One of these was having... I think these guys are in trouble. I mean, it's not a bad idea to have some better naval bases, especially up north here near the Russians. We never know, the Russians could um, actually attack. They did, they did sign a path to the Germans after all. Great, we have the lease, so we're gonna switch over to some other research. We have artillery going. Could get on the doctrine route if I wanted. We need to go to our infantry weapons too here. So we can switch over our infantry weapons. We need to go to our production here. Switch over the Lee to the switch over the Stewart to the Lee. And that will um, basically fill out a bunch of our units here. Available planes in reserve. We can just hang out over the Gulf of Mexico. So we have no template. Okay, I'm just going to force deploy all these units here. And I need to edit our armor template to the armored battalion. Medium tank. I don't have army experience for this. Okay, I got to... I guess we'll just keep training some light divisions here. See, this is why you need army experience. And I'll tell you, we're going to get that when we invade Mexico. Deterrence. You think that's going to stop me, Mexico? <laughs> This is just fun to make a little bit of history. Get some, you know, there's a little bit of mountain fighting. We'll take some guys, but it'll give us some great army experience to help improve our units here. Actually, if you want to fly over. I'd like to actually re... Oh, we have a bunch of fighters we can use here. Let's look for an air base around here. We have one here that says almost 200 planes. Yeah, I think we could use this one. Let's make a new air wing of all our hawks. And I'm going to have these guys do air supremacy there. So I don't even, I can't, I don't even have five experience. That's five army experience. That really sucks. So we, we are getting a little more of this. We could look at a possible another, another person. Amphibious Assault. Okay. We're getting Thomas soon. It'll be very, very useful. So let's look at Germany here. They have taken over all Czechoslovakia, and if we look, the towns have taken over Albania. Let me just see about if Italy is in the Axis, which I don't think they are currently. And then uh, someone, yeah, you can't actually look at how many divisions they have. I actually <laughs> forgot there was a tab there, so. Yeah, they don't really have a whole lot. They have 162. These guys, I was, yeah, Spain does not have a ton. France has, compared to Germany, they don't have a ton right now. <laughs> what do they have here? Military theorists. See, that's what I would need. I wonder if the French even built Ford Salon. There's the Maginot line is like along here. 
Beautiful, we have landing craft that finished. Okay, buddy. Can you go on to this now? Yes, yes, I can. Beautiful. Okay, they're on that. Any more battle plans? Okay. Speaking of Italy, join the Axis. France bans communism. Up, oh, the Germans have signed the pact with the Russians. Wait, what did I just... Nope. Oh, I just messed up. Okay, who else? You guys don't. Okay, now I want just the Marines here. Okay, I'll fix that in a minute. Okay, we need to pause for a second to pick another national research here. Could do the tactical. You know, I wish there was something for the military, like the army. Okay, with some basic army experience, but there is not, sadly. Let's do the escort effort. Let's get a bunch more naval experience. Let's get some more air experience here. Okay, we also have some political stuff here. Do I have a military theorist at all? Air reformer, night operations. These are guys like are all commanders. And... Okay, let's work on our industry a little bit. What do we have more done on our research is the question for our electronics or engineering. Our electronics are coming along pretty well. Our industry needs some stuff. Well guys, I think we're uh, coming to the end of this part here. We're at 31 minutes. I could play this for hours here, but we're on the brink of war here. I'll see you guys in the next part. Codform NT21 signing off. Hope you enjoyed.